people with only fans? Have you ever been randomly recognised in public? If so, what happened? My wife knew a co-worker who was fired for filming herself fingering herself on a vacant hospital bed for her of a cunt. Someone saw her work badge and reported her. When everyone found out, over half of the staff knew who she was and some of them signed up to her help. Years, I was recognised at a modelling event I worked. The guy was also a model. I had the misfortune of working next to him the entire time, where he begged me to pay me to watch him masturbate in real life. It was weird. There's a girl I work with the intentionally, gives out her info where she works at. She did it at her prior job as well. I think it's either to control the situation off the added revenue stream, but it spread like wildfire in a place that employs 1,200 people and I'm shocked she still works here. I worked with a nurse who was a high-level administrator and a bit of a hot. Her husband was an attorney who helped set up. We were at a conference once, and after a few drinks, she admitted that her butt was a banner for several of the sites. I'd never been to them before, but when I looked at it, sure, looked the shape and colour one would expect to be hers. Tame the photo and just the one. The next time we got drunk, she told me the same story was almost the reverse of what Op was probably going for here. Not a warming, but I saw an ex on a random porn site once. I asked if she knew or not since she was an early childhood teacher and it could have cost her her career, and she made out it wasn't her. It had her full face and her tattoos with some of her stuff in the background though, so I think she knew the video I was talking about and got embarrassed or some. We slowly stopped talking. I remember going through history about a few weeks later, and the video was taken down. Obligatory not me. But my cousin-in-law works in porn. We all went out to dinner, and this kid, who couldn't have been more than twenty years old, was at the restaurant with his mom. He keeps eyeing my cousin all shy, and doesn't really know what to say. Probably didn't want to mention in front of his mum where he recognised her from. Eventually cousin and the mum were in the bathroom. Mum nicely asked cousin to take a picture with her kid and she agreed. If only mum knew more. I've been recognised one time by a guy at my favourite coffee shop. He was actually very nice and not creepy, which was awesome. I did send him a picture of my tits with a mug in front as a joke later. Yes, once when I was visiting Dallas, a guy came up to me and said he recognised me by the shirt I was wearing. I wore the shirt in a public nudity shoot I did. It was creepy because after he said hey, he followed me around the mall. I managed to lose him in forever 21 more. I hope I never experience that again. I live in a rock. I saw a very famous milf porn star sitting at a cave. It made me do a double take. Left alone because she seemed to be on a first date with a dude and I didn't want to ruin the date. Recently, in my day job, I had a new client who I was having Zoom meetings with and she was adamant. She knew my voice. She keeps bringing it up every week, asking if I have done radio, podcasts, .o. She keeps joking she will get to the bottom of the mystery some. I started making erotic audio for women and built up a pretty solid following during subsequent lockdowns last year. After she brought this up, I checked my Patreon subs and she subscribed to me nine months ago with her working mail. I honestly am just waiting for the penny to drop. Edit one. Holy crap, this blew the fuck up. Thanks to all of you who have subscribed on Patreon. We'll say hi to you all soon. For everyone messaging about how I got into this, I will write a little update here later, on with some links and general advice. I don't want to spam the comments, but if you want to hear me, just check out the links in my profile. Pornhub is a great place to start for free.